my first trip on my new kayak. It's the Old Town Topwater 106. Just now got my fish finder installed. Took so long, I wanted to do the in-haul wiring kit so I didn't have any wires exposed. Got one there and got one right there behind my fish finder. I don't know if you can see it. That way there's no cables exposed. Got my nine inch Garmin Echo Map or Echo Map. Not really quite sure how to use it too good yet. So I'm gonna have to go home and study up on that now that I finally got it installed. Got that installed on a ram mount. I'm using a 18 amp hour uh, Dakota lithium battery. Let's see. I think that's about it. I mean, I'll give you a better look at it later. I don't know if I'll catch anything. It's already 8.43. It's gonna really get dark here. Probably about half an hour. A little chilly out. But yeah, this is my first kayak trip basically uh, this season and it's May 24th and this ain't really really much of a kayak trip I'm just kind of getting used to getting the, this heavier kayak out and it's kind of hard getting on the wheels that I got I got the sea tug wheels and uh, that's about the hardest part so far. So I gotta get used to doing that. And uh, we'll see how it goes when I get home, putting it up in the storage room. And see I got my side view, clear view, and chirp on the screen right now. At least uh, shows me the bottom. I mean, I can at least make out that much and find out where there's some stumps, rocks, little drop-offs, stuff like that. I'm not sure what the heck's going on with the, the side view. I think you might have to be going so fast for that to, to really work so good. I mean, I know they work in kayaks, but I have to check on that. Maybe I have to change the, the hertz or something. Turn around here. Got my wheels in the back. Don't have a crate yet. Uh, got my uh, black assassin carbon paddle. Uh, I got my anchor trolley. Yak Attack Deluxe Anchor Trolley, but don't have an anchor with me. Like I said, I just kind of a little test run. I'm over here in my favorite cove. I think the water's 68 degrees, so might be a little late. I'm a little, might have missed spawning again. Maybe at the deeper reservoirs though. Might be a little cooler. Might get the end of the spawning season. But whatever, hopefully this year I'll get everything together. Have everything nice and set up to go for next year. That way I can get a nice early start. Back at uh, Lima Lake, where I caught my PB. Just to see if Big Mama's back here. I 
Yeah, I had to order a special bracket for these old town kayaks and these big transducers that Garmin has. Got that from yakhobby.com, which uh, if you don't get those, your uh, transducer will stick out in the bottom of the kayak. You want it up in there as far as you can so it's not sticking out. If you go over any shallow spots or sit it down, you don't want to damage your transducer. I think the top one's telling me how deep the weeds are. Sector about four feet high from the bottom. I'm not sure with those two big rainbow things there are. Assuming that view is like right underneath my kayak. First fish, 2022. Oh, it's a little bitty one. <laughs> of course, rock bass. First fish of 2020, first fish of 2022, it's a rock bass, first fish in the new kayak, alright little buddy, deuces.